remembering the past with warnings about the future. Against the backdrop of commemorations marking the centenary of the World War I armistice, France and Germany have called for a unified approach to bolstering world peace. With one notable exception, world leaders later attended a peace forum in Paris where warnings were uttered against that of blinkered nationalism. But first the theme was raised by French President Emmanuel Macron during his armistice address. Because patriotism is the exact opposite of nationalism. Nationalism is its betrayal. By saying our interests first and you never mind the others, you erase what is most precious to a nation. What makes it exist? What makes it great? What is the most important? Its moral values. Sunday's solemn ceremony remembered the 9.7 million soldiers and 10 million civilians who died in the wars that ravaged Europe between 1914 and 1918. Echoing Macron's comments, German Chancellor Angela Merkel went on to open the three-day peace forum with a veiled dig at President Trump's America First policies. The First World War shows how isolationism leads to destruction. And if isolationism wasn't the right solution more than 100 years ago, how could it simply be the right choice today in an interconnected world that now has five times more people in it? Macron sees himself as Europe's foil to nationalist movements that complain about global approaches. He wants the forum to demonstrate the power of reconciliation a century after Europe was torn apart by one of history's bloodiest conflicts. 